Now to our Verify report. Since the first dose of the COVID vaccine was administered in Arizona, the number of cases has continued to grow. But one 12 News viewer wanted to know if breakthrough cases could be responsible for the recent surge. Colleen Sikora is verifying if it's true. Since the start of the pandemic, Arizona has been through several large waves of COVID-19. The push to vaccinate as many people as possible has slowed down and cases have gone up. So we are asking, are breakthrough cases responsible for the latest COVID-19 surge in Arizona? Our sources are data from the Arizona Department of Health Services, the Centers for Disease Control, and Dr. Natasha Bouillon. AZDHS says breakthrough cases include those who were diagnosed at least 14 days after they were fully vaccinated. The state says of the more than 3.8 million people in Arizona who are fully vaccinated, there have been 72,667 confirmed vaccine breakthrough cases. That equates to 1%. AZDHS says of those cases, 546 have involved deaths, which equates to far less than 1%. So we can say that, no, the surge in cases in Arizona is not related to any breakthrough cases. AZDHS says while rare, breakthrough cases are a reason why those eligible for booster doses should get them as soon as possible, especially those 65 and older who have weaker immune systems. You know, the vast majority of cases that we're seeing in COVID, it's among people that are unvaccinated. And we know that the Delta variant is primarily what's driving these cases. And so the bottom line is, it's important to get vaccinated in order to lower the cases and the spread of COVID. At last report, according to the CDC, those who aren't vaccinated are six times more likely to get COVID-19 than those who have been vaccinated and 11 times more likely to die from the virus. If you have something you'd like us to verify, call, text, or email us. With your Verify, I'm Colleen Sikora.